Hi there, in this video I'm going to take a look at Bluebeam Review on the Surface Studio. Now the Surface Studio would be brilliant for people like uh, building inspectors, surveyors, architects, engineers, construction, anybody who works in the construction industry or consultants, people like that. Anybody who works with plans basically, this device could really replace a plan table and using those physical AO sheets or uh, large format plans that you would typically work with in those sorts of offices. The Surface Studio would run CAD quite well, I imagine. I haven't had an opportunity to do that. But one of the packages that I do use quite regularly on the Surface Studio is Bluebeam Review. And that's a really popular PDF editing package that's used right across the whole industries of architecture, engineering and construction. Working with your PDF plans in Bluebeam Review allows you to get really up close and personal with your documents, just like you would with paper. We can fold the Surface Studio screen down and work with the pen just like you would on those large format plans. Using some of the pen tools here I can draw and add lines and shapes to the document but the Surface Dial also adds some other elements to working with Bluebeam Review on the Surface Studio. Now Bluebeam was one of the launch customers with the Microsoft Surface Studio. They were one of the applications that was demonstrated when Microsoft announced the product. So Bluebeam have actually added a number of functions to the Surface Dial. So if you take your Surface Dial, and by the way, just make sure the underside of it's clean so that it sticks to your display. And if you place it onto your plan and press down the top side of the Surface Dial, you can rotate the dial around and select one of the custom functions for the Surface Studio. For example, the tool chest icon. On the left hand side, it brings up the tool chest for me. And using the dial to scroll will actually move through the different tools that I have laid out in my tool chest on the left hand side. So for example, if I select my landscaping symbols here on the drawing, I can rotate through the different symbols, trees that I have to put onto this plan. And I'll, so I'll place one particular tree type here and I'll rotate the dial around and I'll put a different type of uh, tree symbol on the plan there. So I can quickly scroll through the tool sets that I have available. Here's some other examples using people, uh, different line styles that I've already set up in my own tool chest. Now, if you don't know about the Bluebeam tool chest, that's one of the killer features of Bluebeam that allows you to uh, create and repeat markups and symbols. Uh, and it's worth checking that out on bluebeam.com on their website to have a look at a preview of that particular tool. Press and hold the surface dial and rotate it around to the split zoom function. Split zoom is a really cool feature using Bluebeam Review on the Surface Studio. What split zoom allows me to do when I select that is it opens up a split screen. So I've got two views of the same document side by side. And by default, wherever I put that surface dial on the screen, the right hand pane will be zoomed into that spot. And rotating the dial allows me to zoom in and out of that spot. It kind of feels like using a stethoscope that I'm listening to that particular point. Instead, in this case, I'm seeing it. Once you use it, you'll understand what I mean. Press and hold the dial again and rotate it around. And you'll see another option there is to change the properties of the particular tool that you're using. So I'm going to be using the handwriting tool or the pen tool in Bluebeam Review. And as I select, for example, the pen color, I can rotate that around and change the pen color as I'm drawing. So if I draw a line, rotate the dial a little bit, select a different color and draw another line, it comes out in that particular color. Or if I go back using that gear tool, I can also change the line thickness. So I can rotate that around as I'm drawing and it will tell me what the line thickness. And the other option is the opacity. So I can change the line thickness or the opacity. So those are just a couple of the built-in Surface Dial tools for the Surface Studio running Bluebeam Review. So if you're running Bluebeam Review in your office, but you're still finding that there's a lot of paper circulating around your office, then perhaps the Surface Studio is a solution that will allow you to work like you're working with a piece of paper, but in that digital space. You can get up very direct and very personal with your digital content here on the Surface Studio. Using the pen is a very natural way of working for people who are working with plans all the time. And this whole solution just accommodates that in the digital space.